okay hello it's about uh, uh, pump uh, that I uh, small pump that I just uh, constructed I saw I saw some uh, uh, links on YouTube and I welded uh, the impeller inside I took some uh, picture footage for my blog for later uh, demonstration so this on the left is another uh, motor that I broke opened and used the uh, the bearing here because I could not find a way to make a good bearing with um, with the house and a broken uh, uh, small engine or this is was for a tape or something like this or maybe for a printer helped me and now th this uh, hose does not have uh, any other use but uh, connecting the two uh, devices together because if it they are not uh, linear to one each other, the engine uh, uses more of its strength and the uh, production of the pump yields less uh, pressure. So let's uh, make a shot, uh, take a look at how it works. There is the hole over here that it sucks and this is the place where the water should go out. Now I will start my uh, uh, power um, you see th there is quite a, a good a good uh, pressure and but the the big problem is that it takes a lot of um, just a minute a lot of um, amperage you see with nearly six volts it take if I bring down the amperage the pressure cannot uh, it cannot lift the water but if I go beyond I cannot go beyond one uh, 1.1 1 .1, uh, uh, ampere which is a lot for such a small uh, uh, such a small uh, motor if the it is I thought about using it for a UV pump so if it had to has to work just for a few hours it's not a problem but to let it work for days all the week it is a big waste of um, energy and money of course so uh, for, for the experience it, w it was very good to know what to, you can do but uh, Practically, it's not it's not so uh, uh, money saver. Thanks for watching.